CSAP 15 has many new features uh, as compared to previous iterations of CSAP and each three-year cycle we build in more and more new features in the program uh, to make it uh, more relevant and to promote excellence in surgery. So CSAP um, 15 has a lot more questions, so there is the opportunity to earn the entire set of CME credits that are needed through participation in CSAP uh, for maintenance certification purposes. And what is unique uh, in this um, edition of CSAP is that individuals can claim credit one category at a time. Previously, you had to finish the whole program to get the credits. Now you can do them by category and then get a final completion certificate. But those completion documents by category allow people to submit uh, their various credits to um, the credentialing committees for privileging, for other licensure requirements and so on. People study for their uh, board certification once every 10 years with a high stake exam and CSAP has been used by many of the fellows of the American College of Surgeons to prepare themselves for that exam. The whole key to CSAP is how you actually use the product and all of general surgery is represented in this program in 15 different categories of questions. For instance, if you turn to the section on surgical critical care, what you do is you read a question and then answer the question. It's very similar to actually taking a standardized exam. Then you can immediately flip back in the book or electronically in the electronic version. You go right to the answer. You get immediate feedback about whether your answer is correct or not. And then you can read above this a critique which goes through the rationale for the answer to the question, why the other answers are incorrect, and what the basis of the correct answer uh, is coming from. Well, I was up to be recertified now for the third time in general surgery, and 10 years ago I used CSAP as well to get me prepared for the exam, so I did exactly the same thing. And I was real excited to see that CSAP was even more fun to take this time. I found it easier that I could use it on a computer, I could use it on my handheld device as well, I could stop and start whenever I wanted, and also could go back and review as many times as I wanted. The CSAP program is really designed to promote excellence and expertise. That is the key basis for the success of CSAP. The educational model is built on that uh, um, thinking and also uh, CSAP uh, allows people to repeatedly go through the content so it gets reinforced and gets hardwired into people's thinking. And because of the case-based nature, it helps people apply what they've learned in the practice mode. The easiest way to prepare for maintenance and certification in general surgery is to do CSAP. By the time you've completed it, you've covered all the topics, you've covered the things that are likely to be questioned, and uh, you'll have a lot of fun learning uh, from that experience.